So this week's episode, um, even though it is a bit of a um, sad circumstances, it did get to yeah. reunite you with Alex Kingston. She is with you in the photos. What was it like to see her again? I'm sure it was a joy. Well, it's funny, you know, Alex and I first worked with each other on ER, just down there on the Warner Brothers lot. Mm -hmm. um, I believe it was 12 years ago, which is a kind of a scary thought. But um, so we first encountered each other's sort of love interest on ER and then rekindling that in a somewhat different universe on Arrow over the last few years has been was, has been great. But yes, you know, basically every time um, Dinah pops up, something really bad has generally happened, uh, usually revolving around a daughter's death. Mm -hmm. So go or figure. Or going missing on a boat, I think, too. Yeah, yeah. exactly. You know, yeah, deaths, d disappearances, you know, marriages, divorces, things like that. Mm -hmm. uh, or divorces. Um, so, yes, of course, uh, we have a, a dead daughter on our hands, so here comes Dinah. Um, and, um, yeah, the usual trying to sort out our relationship in those circumstances. Okay. She's amazing to work with, though, Alex. She is just fantastic. You know? Will she get to meet uh, Quentin's uh, current flame? They met at a convention in Salt Lake City. That was interesting. <laughs> well, her well, the character that Alex plays gets the characters. To meet, yeah. No, they didn't. No, Donna. Donna, well. um, Donna. Well, we'll we'll see in the episode. Um, but um, yes, it would be an interesting day if Donna and Dinah were ever in the same room. Let's face it. <laughs> um, and it's a funny thing for Lance because he, when it, you know when he first saw Donna, I always imagined it. You know, there's this strange thing because he's sitting there going. Who is this crazy woman? This is insane. I can't possibly be attracted. I am so attracted to this woman. And, you know, for him to reconcile, why am I attracted to this, you know, extremely unusual woman is something that he's always trying to get his head around. But uh, he's fallen in love with her. You know, they're, uh, they're uh, a good little odd couple. Yeah. Would you like to see that storyline develop get a little more? Get married and have kids? Yeah. Well, yeah, a wedding, <laughs> maybe, like, have kids, maybe go out to some parties together, or just have a, a, a grand old time. It, it would be fine. Actually, we have some juicy stuff coming up in some, uh, in some of the episodes before the end of the season, and a real uh, uh, development in that relationship. And... Um, it's nice to play with. Charlotte's great to play with as well. Not all actors in the world listen to each other when they are um, acting with each other. And uh, we're lucky on this show that we have listening actors, Charlotte being one of them. And you can really get some juicy stuff going then when you're actually you know, reacting.